mediocrity, knows nothing higher than itself. But talent, instantly recognizes genius. To let the brain work without sufficient material, is like racing an engine. It racks itself to pieces. Work is the best antidote of sorrow. There is nothing more stimulating, than a case where everything goes against you. It is stupidity rather than courage to refuse to recognize danger, when it is close upon you. I cannot agree with those who rank modesty among the virtues. To the logician all things should be seen exactly as they are. And to underestimate oneself, is as much a departure from truth, as to exaggerate one's own powers. It's every man's business to see justice done. A man always finds it hard to realize, that he may have finally lost a woman's love, however badly he may have treated her. I follow my own methods, and tell as much or as little as I choose. That is the advantage of being unofficial. Crime is common. Logic is rare. Therefore it is upon the logic, rather than upon the crime that you should dwell. It's a wicked world. And when a clever man turns his brain to crime, it is the worst of all. It is better to learn wisdom late, than never learn it at all. There is nothing more deceptive than an obvious fact. It has long been an axiom of mine, that the little things are infinitely the most important. Never trust to general impressions, my boy, but concentrate yourself upon details. Life is infinitely stranger, than anything which the mind of man could invent. My life is spent in one long effort to escape from the commonplaces of existence. These little problems help me to do so. You see, but you do not observe. It is a capital mistake to theorize before one has data. Insensibly one begins to twist facts to suit theories, instead of theories to suit facts. A strange enigma is man. I never make exceptions, an exception disproves the rule. How often have I said to you, that when you have eliminated the impossible, whatever remains, however improbable, must be the truth. To a great mind, nothing is little. Where there is no imagination, there is no horror. It is a mistake, to confound strangeness with mystery.